YouTube Nation. Welcome back to another epic unboxing. I am Mikey, of course, and this is the Awesome Pack. Um, for anybody who doesn't know, Awesome Pack is uh, tabletop games, family company, um, a family oriented company that puts together boxes catered to families. So if you have uh, a few kids, some dogs, some cats, you can get things catered into your box. Family activities fun things. Check out their website. It's amazing. But they also have what they call Big Kid Box. That's what I get. Biggest kid I know. Um, and I love tabletop games. <clears throat> you fill out a survey, you let them know what you got, you won't get any duplicates. Guaranteed. It's the one thing I like about this box. They keep track of what I have and what they give me. I don't even do that. Um, and every one of these is filled with three games. A big game, a medium sized game and a little game. This is the spoiler card, but it says you've been awesome. And the wait is over. It's awesome time. I agree. Um, only one box that I'd say made me think I didn't want to do this. But uh, I think it was just because it did the, the Duck Dynasty beard thing. I don't know. But otherwise, um, last month, holy smokes, knocked out of the park. It was like three bigs in one box. Pretty cool. I uh, we'll always get some fun paper and my kitties love it. So, without any further gilding the lily, I will jump right into this box. We always get some sort of trinket thing, pin usually. This is a Star Wars Angry Birds. Oh, there's a sticker. Right. sticker. Dog tag. I have no need or desire for this, but it is Star Wars. Do I have to be that collector? Oh, that's cool. Isn't it? Is it cool? I couldn't tell you, but it looks like it's Obi Wan. Does it say on the back? Sorry. No. Maybe that's what this little thing is for. Tags collection. No, it doesn't tell you who they are. They're just like, oh, just put a check mark by it when you get it. And then just keep moving on. Because it doesn't matter who they are. Yeah, we'll just say it's Obi-Wan. Lame. Not their fault. And there is a button. The time to be awesome is now. That's going in the button collection. Alright, I'm going to start with what I assume is the small game. The world's smallest jigsaw puzzle. 204 die cut pieces. What? It's 4 inches by 6 inches. What? And it comes with it. Tweezers. Well, that's ridiculous. And it looks like it's a lot of fun. I like things that make my brain hurt and in a small space. Even better. It's Corvettes, yo. Corvette Dreams. 204. Oh, it just sounds heavy. It's going to be hard. <laughs> oh, yeah, but I'm going to try it. Next thing's next. We have internal affairs. Oh, that sounds very... Um, copish. In Hong Kong, the police and Ruthless Triad Crime Syndicate have both learned they have traitors. Uh-oh. Embedded in their midst. And set upon... Uh, f well, ferreting out the dangerous moles. It's up to you to crack the codes. If for foes and learn the ultimately loyal to whom? Does that even make sense? I don't think I know how to read. But be careful as your own loyalty may change during the game. Oh, you be prepared to do whatever it takes so that when it all has been revealed, you end up on the winning side. Whichever side that is. Two to eight players, eight years or older, 
20 minutes. Okay, fast-paced starter game. It's great for game nights. Anybody that has game night, you know. It's always fun to, you know, get the night started with a, a light, quick game. Where uh, I'll get a few laughs before we get serious for, you know, the global domination that is going to ensue. I don't know why it's always global. Maybe it's because I'm German. And my last name's Hitler. I'm just joking. It's not. It's Rochester. It's not that either. Uh, Viceroy, build your pyramid of power. Cool. Game content, 64 character cards, 24 law cards, 4 auction cards, 64 gemstones, uh, <laughs> 33 magic science tokens, 17 attack defense tokens, 54 powerpoint tokens, 36 bonus tokens, and 4 player screen rule book. Right, it should say. Oh, every game should say. Where is theme phone? The time when everything was decided by brute force has passed. Now politicians are the ones pulling the strings. These skilled manipulators hold mages, warriors, scholars, and noblemen in thrall. They are the most powerful people in the distant and beautiful world of lore. Where the berserker, no, it's just berserk, card game takes place. Use your influence to win the support of all the different walks of life and pass laws required to fortify your position. Prove to entire world that you play by the rules, but always have an ace up your sleeve just in case. Mm. Oh, it was just a comma. Just in case that you believe in the power of magic. <laughs> but our, uh, Prepared to support the development of science, but you are skilled in the art of diplomacy, but not afraid to lead your followers into war. Earn points and climb the steps of the pyramid until each oh until you reach the pinnacle of power. Pinnacle of power. It's definitely a politician's game. You gotta be wish washing. Um I I think it was a good box. Um, the puzzle. I know I'm gonna try it. And I'm gonna get mad. Or I'm gonna sneeze. And then I'll lose a piece. You know that puzzle where it's that last piece? And then the Eternal Affairs game. I can't wait. Try it out. It's uh, open around a game night. Anybody in the area? You wanna have a game night? Hit the brother up. I'm down. Um, let me know what you think. I like the awesome pack. Um, I do. So I think I'll keep it. Um, what do you think? Have you played any of these games? If you have, let me know. Give me details. How do I win? I'll figure it out myself. Um, all right. Thanks so much for watching. Give me a thumbs up if you like it. Give me a thumbs down if you hate it. You're the emperor. You rule my fate. Um, yeah, that's it. Until next video, um, stay out of trouble. Have a great day, morning, evening, or night, wherever you may be. Um, until then, bye.